ba 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 Back row news. We do shit. I mean stuff. Raw. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm your, uh, one of your anchors here, my name is Jim, my name is Bob, just Bob, and um, basically so for our opening we are Back Row News, we are indeed Gordon Ramsay sponsored and Gordon Ramsay approved. Now, for our first story, the uh, the France, our exposition happened lately, and one of our American artists, his name is Paul McCarthy, has made essentially a Christmas tree in France. But the Fran but French, not knowing what the true meaning of art is, believe that it is a an, <laughs> a rear closing device in which for um, certain pleasures. So, the main problem behind this is, well, it's not. It's actually just minimalistic art of showing the true value of Christmas. It stands at 80 foot long, so which means we know for a fact it is not used by the Statue of Liberty, which is really good. And, well... No Christmas spirit whatsoever. No one is right. That is true. But he also made some notable works in which um, George W. Bush does provocative things with some pigs, but that shall be for another story. Thank you, Jim. In today's, in today's weather report... Good morning, USA. This is Rod Burgundy, and here is the weather. On the East Coast, as you will see, it is sunny today. How pleasant. Meanwhile, on the West Coast, it is super sunny. Therefore, renaming the West Coast to the best toast. Mexico is flooding. It's now water. Michigan is suffering extreme thunderstorms. Screw Michigan. There is currently a tornado going on in Montana. The entire state's population of one was decimated. It is snowing in Maine. Such to be made. <laughs> Meanwhile, Canada is suffering from hail. Hell yeah. And that's the weather. Back to you, Jim. And Bob. And Bob. <laughs> Thank you, Ron. <laughs> Thank you, Ron Burgundy. In other news, in today's traffic report, our Route 420, a guy named by Brian Stone, pulls by far the greatest Grand Theft Auto I have ever seen. Here's a clip. Wow. Well, look at oh, him go. Look at that. He's I see just speed, speeding through. I mean, I, to be honest, I do that in GTA. I just go through the shoulder and make sure I pass everybody. Tell me about it. Oh, oh. whoosh, oh. bonus points. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh. Yeah, wow, it's, it's exactly like GTA. Wow. But in real life. Wow, is, is this the guy actually living well? All right. Oh, and, I oh. do exactly the same thing. I just no oh, roads. Who needs roads? I got the water. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It's going. Oh. It's going. All right. Yeah. So he's on. He's on the road again. All right. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Wow. <laughs> this is exactly like GTA. What is that? It's awesome. Oh. Okay. So he's, oh, he's, he appears to go into the other car. He appears to be like telling so you that you hit my car. This, oh. oh wait. Oh, he just opens oh. the door. Why oh. did the person leave unlocked? Get out. Okay. Wow. Took her car. This was new. Something different here. Wow. This is amazing. He got pretty far. Oh, I'm just speeding oh. through. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Oh. Did you oh. say oh. school traffic laws? <laughs> yup. Yeah. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Exact, I do the same exact thing. Wow. He's still good. Look at him. This is GTA. Oh, oh, trying to go for the car. No. Oh. 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 He knows. Okay. He knows. <laughs> 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 all right. uh, he's going far. I mean, he's being a bit sluggish, but it's all right. Uh, why, why hasn't the cops stopped him by now? Cops. Mm. All right, so the United States is running straight to the park lot here. All right. Okay. Is, is he trying to go for another car here? I, I don't think so anymore. All right. Wow, modern America. <laughs> <laughs> Can't even jump a fence anymore. Oh, uh, he had like uh, a long run. Yeah.
Yeah. Like, maybe, maybe, maybe if he did a full, yeah. few more uh, pull-ups when he was in high school, maybe it would have ended differently there. Maybe he actually jumped the fence. Hmm. He made it pretty far. Right, but I don't know, at least the cops got him. Yeah. Good uh, for you, Rhinestone. But moral, moral of the story, uh, if you're playing GTA, this, this might actually happen. Yeah. Yeah. There's inspirations and ideas. <laughs> Alright, it seems cops finally apprehended him there. So, how, how, how long do you think he's going to be in jail for? Hmm. I'd say 10 years. Hmm. Really? Maybe he might go, you know, do a prison break. In other news, Peyton Manning has retired from football. He is currently working for Papa John's making pizza. I like Peyton. Okay. In our top story today, a patient with Ebola in Texas. We go live to Dr. Bob from our Happy Sunshine Daycare Academy. Over to you, Dr. Bob. Hi, I'm Dr. Ball with Agro News, and I'm interviewing Lester today, who has suffered from Ebola. So, Lester, how did you get Ebola? <laughs> ah, I see, Texas is a very scary state. What was the experience like when you got Ebola? Oh, that sucks. I didn't even know you'd come out of there. One of the questions. Are you afraid for your family in Texas? <laughs> that sounds horrible. My sympathies. I know this isn't the right time for this, but are you interested in a job? Happy Sunshine Daycare Academy? Have you, have you ever heard of it? Great! So where do you see yourself in five years? <laughs> so great! I think you got the job. Congratulations. <laughs> now that concludes our interview. Back to you, Bob. Thank you, Dr. Bob. You got it. Oh, I wonder if he's going to be working there, you know, tomorrow, 8 in the morning. Probably one of their best employees. Yeah. Well, that was our back row news for the morning. Thank you.